Hey everybody, Scavenger here. How you doing today? I hope you're doing good. Uh, we're going to be playing some more Being a Dick, so go ahead and smack that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Maybe check out the links in the description if you want to further support the channel. And let's get going. All right, we're here with Isabella and Jill, and I, well, I mean, Jill says help me, so I'm assuming uh, she's asking for help. <laughs> let's, let's actually see what's going on. Uh, what do I do? What do I do? Mm, what are we talking about exactly? I, Isabella, she's always angry. She's always angry. At least she looks angry. Hopefully we figure out what happened to her why is she always so angry oh oh you don't want to fuck with her right now nope tell me something anything i don't know what to say you always have an answer you can think of something you're so naive jill Ex excuse me that's the only thing on my mind at the moment. That's not helping. What were you thinking? Why would you agree to his demands? It reeks of bullshit. What if it's not? Listen. I have one thing to say to you. And this comes from the bottom of my heart. Okay, alright. What's it gonna be? I loathe Tybalt. I know that you don't like him. No, you're too kind with your words. I had him pegged from day one. I've tolerated him for you. But that ends now. I never asked you to tolerate him. You tell me to be nice. Well, yeah, you're staring daggers at him every time you've seen him. That's me being nice. Look, he's only been around because of who I am and who he is. I'm not the type of person to be unfriendly to get rid of someone. That's not how I was raised. Like I said, you're naive. Let me finish my sentence. I see it now. I see what you mean. But I don't see another way out of this that doesn't end up hurting Jonathan. It's just three days. I can endure that. And that's what you think now. What will happen when three days turn into four or five days? He's manipulating you into getting what he wants from you. And what would that be? You're so naive. You know what that will be. Come on. No one's that naive, right? Can you stop saying that? And I don't care what he thinks he can get from me. I'm doing it for Jonathan. Are you going to fix all of the problems Jonathan brings upon himself? I've warned you about him, Jill. This is the other thing I don't get about Isabella. Um, What... What does she see that is so bad about Jonathan? Like, from what I can tell, he's a pretty well-rounded and grounded individual. Unless she's talking about another Jonathan. But she's not. She's not. She's talking about the, the main character, I, I'm pretty sure. Apparently, there's somebody else named Jonathan. Uh, one of you guys told me about. Um... So, I could be getting confused here, but I'm pretty sure right now we're talking about the main character, Jonathan. But th that's the, and if we are, that's what I'm talking about here. Like, I don't get it. I don't get why uh, Isabella is, like, so hellbent on not warming up to him. Because, like I said, well rounded, grounded individual, all that good stuff. Not sure. Anyway. He may be a charming guy, but this isn't the first time. And it won't be the last time he'll need your help. I mean, people need help from time to time. And I don't think Jonathan ever asked for the help. So that's another thing that you should take into consideration. Sometimes lessons are only learned the hard way. Getting sued isn't the way for him to learn his lesson, Bella. Just please help me. <sighs> You already agreed to what he asked? Yes. Then go ahead and date him. But not without letting me know when and where. 
Leave the rest to me. Look at that. Look at that anger. Oh, shit. She's ready. We'll just stay out of her way. Hopefully, Jonathan can, uh, like, maybe get her to come around. You know? All right. We're back uh, at the reception desk at the school. Let's see. Let's see. What are we doing? That takes care of the keys. And finally, sign here, please. And that's it? Won't I get billed for the dorm in the future? Nope, that's it. At least on our end. Make sure you check with the fraternity about the living fee. I got that covered. There are none. We all should be so lucky. What's that? Hm? Enjoy your new house. Okay, alright. Oh, it feels good, doesn't it? Yeah, no more illegal solutions and free living. I feel great. <laughs> That's not exactly free living. We work for it. Yeah, you're absolutely right. How's that going for you? I enjoy it. It takes my mind away from Ashley. Gonna try talking to her today? Nah, it's too early for that. And I think I'm gonna call it a loss and move on. I know what that feels like. That's what I've been doing with Josie. We'll be fine, ass man. Yeah, we will. Kathy. Oh, Kathy. How you doing, Kathy? I hope everything's all right. I saw, I saw some things in a previous episode that I, you know, was a little upset about. Kathy may be leaving us. The letter we saw in a previous episode next to uh, Professor Burke, who was the guy at the computer, um, was Kathy's resignation letter. Thank you guys for pointing that out to me because I was confused as hell. Um, so Kathy uh, may be leaving us. So sad. Don't want to see her go, but uh, I mean, what can we do? I don't know. Maybe I should shut up and continue playing the game. All right. Oh, no. Looks like we're about to take a test, and I just love tests. <laughs> They're the greatest. I don't know what's going on here. Everybody's just... We're just scrolling through pictures here. Uh, even though it's hard, the test seems to be a bit easier today. Is it because I studied a lot? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. We're gonna cheat. <laughs> and we're gonna cheat. And let's see if I can do this one. Negative one, negative two, one... Uh, that one, that one, we got one more, y'all. We've got one more. Now here, one gets deleted, so it'll be this one. Hell yeah, I got 100%. So I only, get, I only cheated on three. I only cheated on three, I got 100%. Psst, ass man. I just noticed something. Take a look at this. Hmm? A curriculum? Um, that's why it's been harder than usual. Kathy skipped ahead of schedule. Huh. Why would she do that? To punish us? No, Kathy's got plans. That's so weird. But at least that should mean that the most challenging part is over. Hmm. See? Yeah, what the hell? How did it go yesterday? It went well. Uh, it was a typical family dinner. Good. I was worried. Thanks to Jonathan. I think it's cool for now. Patrick seemed more relaxed than usual. I hope it means he'll start trusting me more. How have you been? Quite busy. Yesterday we learned more about the sorority and what's required for us to live there. Do you want to hear something great? Yeah, sure. The house is paid for already by the alumni. We have a small sorority fee for each semester, and we have to work a bit to earn the money for the treasury. But there's no other expenses of living there. Mm-hmm. You know, if you change your mind, it could be a big help. Good for you. I'm glad you're getting free accommodation. Yeah, well, you don't have to have that attitude with me. I could have left your dorm altogether. If you know what I mean. I'm sorry, I can't be happy for you. You know why. 
Regardless, I don't think I deserve this treatment from you. I'm still paying for a room that I don't use, and it's all for you. It's for us. Hmm, Maya's not gonna say anything, huh? Hmm? You're right, I'm sorry. I'm just having such a hard time with all of this. I understand, but you don't have to turn on me because of it. Try with me, okay? Okay. Alright, that's good. That's good. Like I said in the, uh, the previous videos, like, Maya's being... Uh, I don't want to say selfish, but kind of. I don't know a better word for it. Like, she's only... Th I guess it's selfish, because she's really only thinking of herself and not the entire situation. It's shitty, I know. But there's a better way to go about it. And I, I think she could sacrifice... Uh, some of her feelings for Josie by staying at the mansion. It's the best situation, in my opinion. Anyway, anyway, back to class, which is now dismissed. It's dismissed. Jonathan, can you stay for five minutes? I would like to have a word with you. Oh, shit. Okay, what did Jonathan do? I hope we're, I hope we're okay. Yes something wrong with my test she found out I was cheating this can't be good oh that okay um why are you, why are you showing me that uh, I, I I'm sorry I didn't think it would turn out this way no there's no need to apologize for something that you're not responsible for I hoped it would go away but it turned out that that was a naive way of looking at this Yet, I can't fathom that this turned into adult bullying. These flyers, they're everywhere. Yeah, that's because of the other fraternity. Because of the jocks. There will be some changes in class next week. I've decided to move on and find new employment. What? You're quitting? Yes, and I appreciate it if you won't spread it further until it's official. I'd like my last week here to be as normal as it gets. Okay, um, yeah, I won't, I won't tell anyone. Where will you go? I have options. I've always had options, yet I've been too afraid to explore them. I'm not close to retirement, and now is a perfect opportunity for a fresh start and get new motivation. Weirdly, I'm looking forward to this change of vocation. And because I'm leaving like this, I wanted to have a word with you. As I gather, you and Russell are close. Russell? Who's Russell? Oh, you mean Rusty. Okay, okay. He's a nice young man with great potential. I fear that my departure will affect him negatively. Bless his heart. He tends to blame himself for his mistakes. But you probably know that. Uh, I didn't know that, actually. Oh. Either way, I trust you to reassure him that I don't blame him for this. This is not his fault. Can you do that for me? Uh, yeah, I can do that. Well, um, I'm gonna miss you. I think it's sad that you're leaving like this. Jonathan, I've always liked you. You and Derek. You have been my favorite students. Really? <laughs> best of luck with college, Jonathan. I know you'll do great if you give it your best. Oh, okay. Well, shit. That was nice of her. I didn't know I was one of her favorite students, but okay. But okay. And we're running into Jill. Hey, you going this way? Hi. Uh, yeah, I have a class. Cool. We could catch up. I'll walk with you. Mm, maybe it's best if you don't. Okay, that's weird. Why uh, did I do something wrong? Listen, I... I can't see you anymore. At least not for a while. Because... Because of what you did. So I did do something. Okay, what is it? Are you kidding me? You broke into our mansion and started a fire. And you punched an egg tieball on others. Hey, okay, all of that's not true. I didn't start a fire. And it, and it wasn't really a break-in. Who told you that? Tybalt told me that you did, and he has witnesses. Well, Tybalt's full of shit. I was at the party, but I didn't start a fire. 
I'm not gonna blame Derek. What do I look like? I'll take part of the blame, I guess. Derek and I started the sprinkler system to stop the party. I realize that doesn't make it better, but we didn't try to burn the place down. And that's ridiculous. Even so, he has witnesses, and you did do something illegal. I don't want to get you sued over this, and if I keep seeing you, that's what will happen. What? Is he blackmailing you? It's more of an agreement. I've talked to Bella about this. There's a way out of this where you won't get sued and we can see each other again. You'll just have to trust me on that. Okay. But it'll take some time. Okay, so how, like, how long are we talking about? I can't say for sure. A few weeks, maybe? A month? That sucks. Hey, I'm sorry for causing you any trouble. It's not fair that my problems are affecting you. Let's stick to phones for a while, okay? I want to ensure that you're in the clear first. So don't do anything to make this worse. I'm serious. Okay. Okay. I'll try. <laughs> Fucking Tybalt. What a creep he is. Uh, I feel like a shit for dragging Jill into this. And we're done. Um, I think, I think we can wrap it up right here because it looks like we're about to get into, um, uh, basically the, what do you call it? Probably going to sum up the, like the weekly tasks and everything to see where cleaning is and to see how much money we made and all that stuff. And, um, that kind of, it can get a little, it's just not that entertaining. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and wrap it up here and we'll see what happens in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, as always, you know what to do. Go ahead and smack that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.